Before we get into it, I just want to say that today's video has been sponsored by OneFootball. OneFootball is a great football news app available for iOS and Android that covers over 100 different leagues and competitions. It's a great app for keeping up with the latest scores, news, transfer rumors, and more. If you don't already have it, then I definitely recommend checking out the link in the description. Thanks again to OneFootball for sponsoring today's video. Hello guys, Lewis here. Welcome back to another video. I know this is real what you're looking at. The FIFA 20 Icon Squad file for career mode. You can use it for pretty much every mode now. And uh, yeah, I'll go into the, uh, in, in depth in this tutorial and how you can install it and uh, just generally how the mod works and stuff. But as you can see, we've got all the icons in career mode here. Lots of them. Every single one, there's 89, I believe. Obviously, there's some players there, and these are not all 89 of them. The rest are on the free agents because you can't have that many, you can't have 89 players on the team. But all 89 icons in the game with their real faces, their mini faces, everything like that. So you saw those. Then there's all these. Look at that. So a ton, a ton of icons. You can see all of them have their mini faces, the real stats. And yes, this is just the prime icons, not the baby and not the old versions. Um, and I'll also make variations like baby with prime potential, stuff like that. That will be coming in the following week. So make sure you subscribe to this channel, like this video, and hit the bell uh, to get notified when that video goes out. Should be in a few days, I think. Um, but yeah, uh, uh, let me just show you some of their in-game faces. We got Baggio, Zidane, Hari, Ronaldinho, Ronaldo, Berezi, Carlos Alberto, Maradona, Maradona, uh, Cruyff, Van Basten, Hullet, Best, Pele, Yashin, Puyol, Burkamp, Schmeichel, Mateus, Maldini, Eusebio, Garincha, Dolgish. So obviously we can see uh, that they do have all their beautiful in-game faces. And yeah, I'll link a video in the description that Bmon has made. He goes into a bit uh, more depth of how the squad battles work and stuff. This one is a bit more on how to install it. So yeah, let's get into that. So now the first step of uh, getting this mod into FIFA 20 is to download it. Um, uh, that's quite obvious, but to do it, it's actually a bit harder than you might expect. If you're good with computers, you can probably do it quite easily, but you might just want to watch this because you have to do it a bit precisely. But you want to go to this link in the description, fightformods.com forwards slash FIFA dash 20 dash prime dash icons dash squad dash file. Um, and it will bring you here. Make sure to disable your ad blocker so that you can get in and everything. Uh, if there's an ad, you can just close it out. And uh, as we can see here, you, it, this is the video they're watching right now. You can see the images here. Obviously, the, you know, these are some of the icons, as we can see here. For y'all, Ronaldinho, Pele, there we go. And um, uh, here is the download to the media file link. Uh, so you can open that. The virus called scan Reddit thread soccer gaming modding way, my channel, Patreon, PayPal, uh, and then live support report dead link description, Discord servers, contact, everything like that. But you go here. Now this file is just over six megabytes, six and a half about. Uh, so it's very small, should only take a few seconds to download. So just download that. It's a .so file. It's 100% safe. It's just uh, the, the format that uh, FIFA uses for its squad files. So once it's finished downloading, what you're going to want to do is go into File Explorer. Then you're going to want to go Documents, FIFA 20, Settings. You might not have all these folders, whatever, just go into the settings folder and you'll see a bunch of files maybe, maybe you won't, but you'll see a bunch of that and uh, yeah, you want to grab this file, drag it into there or however, however, just get it into there and there you go. Squads, prime icons, 25 year old. So as you can see, that's all good. Um, and yeah, next up you want to open FIFA. You can do it via Origin, you can do it via Frosty, anything like that. Just open FIFA and uh, once it's opened, I'll get back to you. Also, uh, before we get into how to open it in FIFA, I just want to uh, give a big shout out to Naffer, or Na Naffer FIFA, I think is how you pronounce it. Um, he helped me a lot with these squad files, it wouldn't have been possible without him. So, uh, as you can see, this is his Twitter, I recommend you go follow him on there. He has about 450 currently, let's get him up to, to 500 or more. But uh, he, he makes great mods, he, uh, he's an editor for FIFA Infinity, and uh, yeah, you, you'll see some more of his mods in the future, uh, I think. Yeah, I'm just giving him a big shout out, um, and yeah. 
It does lots of cool stuff, like you can get Alex Morgan as a manager, and I'll make tutorials on all of this. But he's teaching me a lot, stuff like that. You'll see a lot of tutorials in the future of how to edit comp data, stuff like that, and some really interesting stuff. So make sure you go follow him, and uh, yeah, let's get on how you can load it in FIFA. So once FIFA is on the main menu, you want to go to the Customize section. It's the last tab up here. And then you want to go to Profile, Load Squads, and you want to load the one called Icons Prime. Now you can check the uh, late mod the date modified with this one if you're not sure which one it is, but yeah. Then you might go to Team Sheets and you might be like, hey, where are the prime icons? Well, they're all on the free agents. So if you start a new career like this, they will some will remain free agents, some will uh, still just go to a random team. But um, if you want to put them all on a team, distribute them, obviously there's not, uh, 89 and you can only have 52 ones on a team. But they're all on free agents, so you just go here, and you can see Pele, you got the prime stats, name, the mini face, the in-game face, everything like that. So yeah, we can put them on any team we want. So now let me quickly go through uh, all the icons before I show you how you can start a career with them. Um, let me go show you all the icons uh, with their in-game faces. So you got Garincia. Eusebio, Maldini, Matthias, Yashin, Pele, Cruyff, Maradona, Ronaldo, Ronaldinho, Zidane, Dalgish, Schmeichel, Bergkamp, Puyol, uh, Del Piero, George Best, Reid Hullet, Van Basten, Carlos Alberto, Berezi, uh, Thierry Henry, Baggio, as well as Gary Lineker, uh, Vitrango, as well as Lineker, Betrango, Moore, Sanchez, Raul, Van Nistelrooy, uh, <coughs> uh, Pir Pirlo, uh, Luis Vigo, I'll skip this one because I can't pronounce his name, Rivaldo, Cannavaro, Nesta, plus the likes of uh, Pep Guardiola, or Joseph Guardiola, Veron, Veri, Seedorf, Desai, Paul Scholes, Alan Shearer, Zambretta, Ian Wright, Barnes, Gattuso, Campbell, Akacha, Roy Keane, Nakata, Ian Rush, Marioslav Klose, uh, Blanc, Roberto Carlos, Patrick Vieira, uh, Zanetti, Ryan Giggs, and obviously Larson, Overmars, Rijkaard, uh, Hernandez, Deco, Essen, Crespo, Rio Ferdinand, obviously, Litmanen. Uh, Frank Lampard, Makalele, Emmanuel Petit, uh, Zola, Inzaghi, Rui Costa, Jens Lehmann, plus you got the likes of Patrick Cliver, Laudrop, Socrates, Komen, Hag Haji, Hierro, Kaká, Van de Sar, Drogba, Steven Gerrard, Shevchenko, Neved, Trezeguet, Michael Owen, Balak, uh, Pires, and yeah, that is all of the icons with their in-game faces and stuff. So, uh, how you want to actually start your career mode, there's one little thing, you can go new career. And obviously these are pretty latest squads, they're the one that came out after, like, the transfer update. So, uh, obviously Sanchez is on loan at, uh, Inter and stuff like that. But, uh, I will be updating these, or maybe Naffer will help me with that. But, uh, I think we next plan to update them, uh, probably in December. We'll probably do one update uh, in December, January, probably, depending on how much time we have. Maybe there'll be one every month or something. Or thinking after the January update or something like that. And then maybe one in, uh, in April or June or something. But yeah, how I mean, you want to start your career is uh, what's really important. I just skipped over the step. But uh, when you start a new career, it's going to ask you what squads you want to use. Now, you need to click Use Current Squads. Download Latest. If it's available, we'll overwrite the squads. You have to install them again. And Use Initial Squads. We'll use the default squads, um, and you don't want that. So you want to click on Use Current Squads. You can do Player Career if you want. You could play as one of the icons. Wouldn't that be sick? You could relive a career with one of the icons. Select the manager. All of this obviously does not matter. Whatever team you select does not matter. You can literally do anything with these settings. But yeah, I'll uh, just show you something in game quickly. Obviously, preseason tournaments does not matter. But I started with Crystal Palace and I assigned some icons to them. So we can go into Squad Hub and see them. So obviously, we got all of them and they're all 25. And um, as we can see, yeah, this is so cool with their in-game face and everything. 
We can see their attributes, their traits, everything like that. We can see their finances. Who's who's worth the most, I wonder? It's Inzaghi tied with Crespo and Luis Hernandez and Larson and Zola. So that's that's quite interesting. They're all 90 overall, I guess. But yeah, it's just fun to mess around. You can do a bunch of experiments with them. But obviously you might be asking, where's the old squad file with the old icons? The baby squad file, the baby with prime potential, maybe uh, baby icons with very low rated stats with prime potential and they're all like 16, 15, 14. Um, those are coming soon. Next week I should get out the baby one and then the week after that the old one and then maybe baby with prime potential, stuff like that. Um, at least one each week. I might even get another one out uh, on the weekend or something like that. But uh, yeah, uh, obviously I've linked a video in the description uh, that B Monus has made um, and I probably one from Rich Lee about just more about the actual icons themselves and um, yeah obviously big things coming if you want to test my realism mod go back to my last video stuff like that but yeah um, if you have any questions make sure to join the discords linked below uh, or comment down below and I'll try to help you but yeah I hope you guys have a fantastic day make sure to share this video with your friends and yeah hope you guys have a fantastic day I'll see you guys in the next one goodbye